Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week, we go seven hours a day, we go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Don't make assumptions. Communicate with clarity. Communicate with others as clearly as you can to avoid misunderstanding, sadness, and drama. If all humans would communicate with impeccability of the word, all our relationships would change. There'd be no wars, no violence, and no misunderstandings. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down six, NASDAQ off 147, SP's down 32, gold contract down $2, trading at 16.73 an ounce. We had silver down 49 cents, 19 dollars 12 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude off 2 dollars 69 cents, 88 dollars 42 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds, a 10-year note trading up six ticks right now at a price point of 111.06. The 30 up 16 at 124.21 in King Dollar. King Dollar is up 179 ticks trading 113, 329. The euro is at 97. The yen is at, out here at a price point of uh, 145, and the British pound is at 109 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. We'll know what's going on in your world. So the 10-year note right now, folks, is yielding 3.944. No, 3 3.933. And the high is 3.945. So we're going to go over and look at this bond first. Because this is all about bonds. Well, it's not all about, but bonds and currencies are moving the market in a monster way. So we take a look at this. Yep, I can see it. Okay, so last low, well, that was the high, 110.19. You got the 110.21 out here. Real question is, is it going to be able to get off this baby? Well, here's how it shakes out, man. This is going to be interesting. So, 110.19 is the low. That had 2.9 million contracts. So, one, we're at 1 1.4. Yesterday, hey, we'll, we'll see. I mean, this is saying that there's a lot less sellers down at this area. And, you know, of course, this went straight down from 122. You know, down to 118, I mean, 110, yeah, 110, 19. So bottom line is that, you know, you could get a bounce going. There's no doubt about that. So now let's go look at the broad market. Let's go take a look at the S&P first. We'll take a look at the SPY. What you have with the SPY is this. So you're going into the swing point, which is uh, 357.04. We broke it. Um, that's 153 million shares. Now, we're only at 64 million shares. So this is a big number, man, meaning that if this can close above the 357.04 today, you're going to get action. I mean, this is acting, I can tell you this, this is acting like it wants to make a, a bottom that's going to last for a while. Now, my take is that we're going to go a lot lower in the S&P, meaning about another 500 points. But when you have a, a, a like, the way this is coming into lows, um, it looks to me that we're making a bottom. What I mean by that is this. Bottoms that last a longer period of time actually do something like this, like we're done today. First, you test. Yeah, yesterday was a test. You know, bottom line was Columbus Day, but the bottom line, the volume was a lot less. Today's a lot less, and normally when you're trying to get off something like this, you know, the nerves are, are there. I mean, I can see in this case here, you went up, you pulled all the way back in about two seconds flat, and we know that we got the CPI coming out tomorrow. We take a look at the Qs. Now, the Qs are in, in a different ball game. They're, they just are. I mean, you know, they, they broke lower. The real question, I mean, the Qs in order to get to higher price have to get to 269.28. Uh, the volume's contracting. There's, there's no doubt about that. Volume's contracting. But guess what? <laughs> that, that's about it, man. Because when you take a look at inside the Qs, you got Amgen up 5.3%. Micron's up 2.8%. Walgreens Boots is up 2. 
taken away from it. Now, this is the killer, man. Lamb's down 7.8%. Clack is down 75 You know, we've talked about this so many times, man. The bottom line is that the chips take you up, the chips take you down, the chips are getting killed. So, and Lamb Research, look at this. This is an ABC down, man. This is a uh, 453. This is a monster, too. You get, uh, what? So that's four, what did I say, 53? So there's 53 plus, what is that number? 50, plus 40, 90, 90, 98. That gets a 308. Oh, you're 324. Let's see, it's a 308. It's down 25 bucks out here. 304 is the ABC down. Yeah. Now look at this. 309 is the high of the low, I think, of May 2020. These, this, folks, the, the, the COVID high, the COVID bar is what everything's going after, man. There it is right there. Look at that. Yep, 309, man. That's the highs of the lows. And you can see, I mean, the bottom line is that we went up. You come off the highs with volume. Yeah. Let's get over the oil market. So the oil's taking a hit out here. Uh, get the active contract. It looks like you get some volume on this hit too, man. Okay, so you get 284,000 contracts. Nah, volume's not that high. We made a, yeah, volume's not that high. You need another day like uh, with heavier volume than today. You know, what's stopping in its tracks, though, is uh, the downdraft that was established out here on the 20th of August. That's when oil went from uh, 96 to $90. That stopped it in its tracks on the way up. There's no doubt about that. So we'll see where that whole baby's going to shake out. And we'll also see, you know, what kind of uh, traction you're going to get coming into this close. Because uh, right now, they're, they're pressing, they just pressed out the lows, uh, meaning took out the lows. And the real question is going to be, now, this is what ends up happening. Because it's only quarter past three, taking out the lows, this would be the time you, you want to take out the lows if you think you're going to get a turnaround. You don't want to take those lows out at quarter of four. You know, 45 minutes left, yeah, you can see it's called a spike low, folks. You come into the low, you test the low, then you spike the low, and then you get out of the low. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.